Hello, hello. So uh, <clears throat> this is an old laptop that I use. Um, it's an uh, Dell Studio 1558. And I'm usually running Ubuntu on this one. So Linux. Uh, yeah, it's kind of old. The monitor is just, uh, it's not full HD. It's just 1366 by 768 or something. It has a uh, dual core CPU from Intel. Uh, it has hyper threading though, so it's two cores, four threads. Uh, I also installed some extra memory in it. Um, I took it from a different laptop. So it got eight gigabyte of DDR3 memory. And I actually managed to install PF Sense on it, and it's a firewall slash router. And yeah, I got normally this uh, PC only got one Ethernet connector or Ethernet port. So I got this uh, USB Ethernet, it's a cheap one from Del Taco, I think it was. And you connect it to a USB port. It's gigabit. But the problem is that the USB ports on this computer are only USB 2. So the maximum speed of USB 2 is 480 megabit. So you, get, you can't get any gigabit speed out of it. But I thought, well, PFSense might work because... Right now I'm just running a desktop computer with PFSense and uh, I'm getting a uh, 500 megabit connection to the internet. So 480 is very close to 500. So uh, I thought, well, I'm going to try if this USB ethernet actually works with PFSense because I know that PFSense is a bit sensitive when it comes to what kind of network card she's using. But uh, right now you can actually see this, it says WAN, and that's this one, the USB, and it's actually getting, right now I have a back there, it's a, um, my sort of secondary internet, it's connected to the cable TV network. So my WAN is going to that, and then my LAN is connected to my regular network, that switch there. And both network cars getting an IP address. And that box there as well, it also gives out an IP version 6 address, and that's the long one over there. So yeah. Um, the only downside right now I don't know if you can hear it, but the fan is actually running kind of high. It's not full speed, but half speed at least. So uh, this computer consumes a maximum of 40 watts. And since the uh, fan is spinning up, I guess it consumes about 30 watts right now. Um, so yeah, I don't know. If I'm going to use this computer as a router. Um, so we'll see. I will test it when I get the 500 megabit. I will get that in about two weeks. Right now I got 250 down and 100 up. So we'll see. We'll see. I'm going to try it out. But it's kind of fun to test it out. Uh, of course you need to set it up with the web GUI. This is just the... Uh, so console. Uh, so you set it up the normal way on a different computer with a web browser. But yeah, it seems to be actually working with the USB uh, Ethernet adapter. So yeah, I might try this out later on, see how it works. So uh, yeah, catch you later.